Um, where is the interview person? I'm down here. Yeah, thanks a lot for making me feel short, camera. Anyway, my name is Applesauce. Don't judge me by my tiny size. I may be tiny, but I am fierce. Fiercer than any lion that you'd ever meet. Don't mess with me. You understand, camera? Uh-huh. I understand. Good. Anyway, I am a happy, sassy girl who is sensitive to the word tiny. If you say the word tiny, you're in big trouble. And don't you dare even think about saying midget. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, I act a lot like Tiny P from Veggie Tales. Or Midget Apple. Hey, I'm talking here! <laughs> I love apples a lot. That's why like my name is Apple. Apple. Uh, <laughs> stop talking for me. I love apples, and I love applesauce. I love them. I love recess. I love the color red. And I love apples. I love giraffes because they love apples. I love summer because that's when you can pick apples. I love making applesauce. I love Isaac Newton because he got hit in the head by an apple. Do you, do, do. And I am in love with Patrick Whitley. I'm going to marry him. Did you hear me? Me and him, we're going to be honey poo one day. We're going to be honey poo do you like? Do you like midget apple? <laughs> what are you doing? Stop telling me. I hate history. I hate the color green. I hate Brussels sprouts. I hate the winter. I hate cleaning my room. And I hate the old Napoleon Rupert Burger because he's really stupid. Hate him. Oh, yeah, and I'm allergic to bananas. Don't tell banana curls or banana frills that I said that because they will go completely cuckoo crazy. I'm so serious. Like cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs crazy. Anyway, that's enough about me. Oh, wait, wait, one more thing. I'm a firefighter. Wait, what? Aren't you a little small to be a firefighter for Baby Town? No, I'm not. I'm the firefighter for Baby Town. Even though I never got to use the truck yet, except for spraying people in order to get them to get up and go to school, I haven't been able to use it yet to fight any fires yet because Baby Town's really safe. But hopefully, maybe I can set a building on fire so that way I'll have an excuse to use my fire truck. And then I can go blaming people on why did you leave your toaster on while, while your house was flooding and all that stuff. Anyway, bye!